Kyron's mom tells me she's not giving up the search for her son, and she's hoping the new pictures on semi-trucks in our region will bring Kyron back home. <laughs> a mother's pain, still fresh after two and a half years of searching for her little boy. I try to stay focused on all the things that I want to experience still, all the things that I want back, the hugs and the moments and the smiles. Her son, seven-year-old Kyron Horman, went missing in the Portland area in June of 2010, but today, a ray of hope. They're releasing a new age progression photo uh, that is going to be put on the Gordon Trucking semi-trucks. The photo shows Kyron as he might look today at 10 years old. Monday morning, trucks with the picture were unveiled in Seattle, Washington. When I uh, first got the photo, I cried because it's really difficult. Odd for a mother who says she remembers her smiling little boy as he was. I think of Kyron the same way I last saw him. I feel like time hasn't passed since 2010. But it has, and she hopes the photos will trigger new tips and get her closer to finding answers, and eventually, her son. I want to see his smile again. I want to be able to hug him and hear him laugh. With all her heart, hanging on to the hope that these pictures will make the difference in a case that's gone more than two years unsolved. Now I'm told Kyron's picture will be on five trucks, some of which will drive all over the United States. If you have seen Kyron or have any information, you can call 911 or the tip line at 503-261-2847. In the studio, Christine Pinawanich, NBC5 News.